Hey Nord Anglia, this is Rahi Patel coming to you live from MIT where I'm being chased by a giant tornado of your creative final projects. Come on, we gotta go find Dr. Emanuel. Wow, Nord Anglia, that was really something. A spectacular job. I was very interested in the presentations and I uh, thank all of you uh, for your submissions. All very interesting. Thank you. The Village School integrated this challenge into every grade level and discipline, including social sciences and art. As part of this effort, some students made extreme weather warning devices. But if we were to add more water, because of maybe a flood, when these balls connect, when the wind is high like this, then it will trigger the alarm. Well, thank you very much. That's very impressive to see a whole school, a village school, uh, get involved in this project. It was really nice to see the video and great to see the thought that went into creating alarms that could warn people about high winds and flooding. So uh, I take my hat off to you. Very nice work. Myra from Oak Ridge International School, Bangalore, gave an exceptionally detailed forecast for each day before the storm. She also provided many helpful tips. It's still moving nearer, but hasn't quite reached Arangalina yet. The situation is similar to how it was yesterday. Stay away from windows and doors that lead outside your house, and it's safer to stay in an interior room. The Nord Anglia Weather News Channel has its own special portable emergency radio for weather updates with a special alarm in case of emergencies. Well, thank you very much, Myra. I think that's a spectacular job that you did uh, and, and thinking very clearly about how one goes about communicating a risk to people who are in danger. This is something that professional meteorologists spend a good deal of their time trying to do, and uh, you're quite a natural at it. <sighs> This storm has finally calmed down. Thank you all so much for your submissions. Now, over to Dr. Emanuel with some final thoughts. All your interest in the weather is wonderful to hear about. And unfortunately, we live in a world where climate is changing and affecting the weather. And so weather is going to become more and more important to many people's lives. And that's all the more reason why your work on this is important. And I hope at least some of you keep it up and make careers out of it. Thanks so much, Nord Anglia. Keep up the good work.